Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the third episode of Prodigy Hardcore. Now, in our last episode, we completed Sage 2 and got ourselves the Cake Topper. Not to mention, we also pulled this bad boy in a very good chest. But in today's episode, we are going to be completing Stage 3 and getting one step closer to that final boss. Alrighty boys, let's just go ahead and go up here and see what we can find. We see a bush over here, we like these bushes. We're gonna get a really useless food item. Alright, we're gonna go to the right here, see what we can get out of this. Maybe another chest or something, I definitely wouldn't mind that. Okay, there's a monster right there. We have an Igneos over there, so we'll keep that in mind. We do have another bush and a monster over there as well. That bush is not gonna give us anything. We're gonna go down here and see what we can find. Oh... Okay, so that's the lone monster that gets us there. We're gonna have to use a bit of strategy here, boys. Do we want to see what else we can find down here? Because I don't want to risk bumping into that Igneos. Nothing down there, okay. Igneos is right there, okay? We're not gonna go there. Nothing happening over there. There might be a good chest down there, though. Is it worth the battle for the Igneos? I mean, if we find a really good... Yeah, all right, you know what? We're gonna go... We're gonna loop it around. If we can somehow manage to skip it... Oh, okay, yes, here we go, here we go. Oh, yes, let's go, boys! Boys, it pays off the strategy. Now we can sort of loop it back around and go battle that Flickfoot. There it is, boys. The only thing that stands between us in the final stage. All right, I just realized I've been calling it a flick fit the whole time. It's actually three Zarazags. Now, we are getting about 1,000 extra health with this cake topper, so that's definitely good for us. How much damage, though? Who oh, we missed! I think the smartest thing to do whenever they miss is to just use an area attack, whether that be supernova or anything else. This way, we can get a good amount of damage on everybody. I mean, if they're gonna keep giving us free hits, we're just gonna keep using supernovas. We'll definitely take this. Hold on, one more supernova could do it. That one's dead. We could win this battle. 4,000 damage, let's go, boys. Uh, we don't have enough energy, though. Okay, tell you what, I wanna get that one shot. Now, I know this is stupid, and this might cost me the battle, but I want- He missed! Let's go, boys! We're dominating, let's go! Can we do it? The one shot for the win! Here we go, boys! Yes! Yes! Let's go! One down! Two down! That's what I'm talking about, boys! You know, I'm okay with that. We might use it in the future, we might not. There we go. We got the double seed. Oh, there's a bush up here. Okay, we have the final stage here. What a battle, boys. We absolutely dominated in that. Three stages down, one final boss battle to go. But before we end this video, we get to do our final wheel spin of the series. This is it, boys. Our final wheel spin of the series. We have gear, we have boots, and we have relic. I'm kind of pulling for a relic here because I really want to do some extra damage on that final boss battle. The spin has been initiated. Here we go. Please get a relic. I mean, I'll take the extra health, but if it comes down to it, I want that relic, boys. Here we go. Here we go. It's kind of glitch. Here we go, boys. It's kind of spinning. It's spinning. We're rolling. We're rolling. Get that relic. Come on. Relic. 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 Relic! No! Yes! Oh! You know, we'll take the extra gear. We're gonna be rolling with Celestial Armor, giving us that heart bonus 10. Would I have liked the Relic? Yes. But we're gonna get some extra health, which I think will help us in the next battle. But guys, that is gonna have to wrap it up for this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like, subscribe, and comment your thoughts. Anyway, I'll catch you on the flip-flop.